Sadly Pickle67. Today we're going to be going over my Nerf guns. This is my first upload. I did say I was going to bring my channel back, so this is how I'm going to do it. Um, I'm doing every class, my favorite Nerf gun that I have. Pistol, shotgun, AR, I don't know what that would be considered, and SMG, and then sniper. So, I'm going to put my customizations on them. This is what they look like without them. The first one is, I forget what this is called. It's the Boomco Pistol. Very powerful, very fast. The second one is, I, I know this is the, one of the break fire guns. It's Nerf, as you can see, it's not off brand. This one also doesn't say, it shows how old it is, but I know this is a break front because to load it, you have to break the front down and then you shut it. Oh, I can't do it with one hand, but that's how you would load that. Eh. This is the new Nerf regulator with no customizations on it. This is the Mega Cyclone Shock. Cyclone Shock, yeah, that's what it's called. This is the classic Nerf Orange Elite Strife. Pretty basic. And then this is the Mega Centurion. You, you guys all know that. I, put, I have a... My dot site on it at the moment. The site's not on at the moment, but when I will be doing the firing range, it will be. So, with that being said, I'll see you guys with all the customizations on. Alright, guys, this is the, what the pistol looked like after I customized it. There wasn't much since this is a Boom Co gun. I mean, it really only had the site, ra the rail. So, I put on a Nerf site. It doesn't exactly fit, but works. Same thing with the shotgun here. I mean, it is a great shotgun. You can't do too much with it. One of my first Nerf guns, actually. It's probably why I'm so attached with it. Next thing, this one's new. I didn't have any scopes left. So I couldn't add anything new to this one. This is the Cyclone Shot. Onto the stripe, I added a lot to this thing. I had a stock, 10 banana mag. This thing was glitching out before, so, well, not glitching. A, a hand, hand, single hand grip. And then a muzzle. And then the big boys. Oh, uh, no. I added a grip from the um, modulus. I put it on single shot mode. Um, it has a muzzle as well, as long as it's stock. And a 10 banana mag. Then this thing. <laughs> I didn't add much since I already had the sight on it. Really, all I added was the trap, the bipod, and I loaded the magazine. Well, with that being said, I think it's time to go to the firing range. Pistol, we're in the firing range. I'm going to be shooting two rounds at a time. Four, because I only have two bullets for it. And let's begin. Two more rounds with this gun, and then we're going to go on to the shotgun. Alright, on to the shotgun. Shotgun. Reloading this thing is a snap. I am doing this now because I won't be able to show you while I'm shooting. So you'll be watching the bullets. But as you can see, it's easy like that and you're ready to shoot. Alright, on to the firing range. I'm not expecting this thing to go that far. It is a shotgun and it is like three years old, so prepare for that. Alright, two more shots. Ooh, one of those went far. Alright, last two shots for the shotgun. Alright. Alright, so guys, this is the Mega Cyber Shock, I believe. And we Cyclone Shock. We will be shooting this. We will be shooting two rounds of six. Let's get into it. Alright, so that... No, it's not one mag. I missed the Alright, sorry about that. Alright guys, on to the slam fire. This is going to probably mess up. Because I don't know if this gun can even slam fire, but I'm going to try. Yeah, <laughs> it jammed. 
All right, starting next up is the Strife. I have a six mag in it, and I'll be shooting a ten mag after. Six, so I'm going to do single shot, and ten, I'm going to do Spitfire. Um, reloading is quick and easy again. Excuse that. And you're ready to shoot. All right, starting with six mag, single fire. All right, that's six. I knew this was gonna happen right as I started. Sorry, it's messing up. But batteries just died. All right. Well, the batteries just died, guys, so uh, that's enough for the strife. Now we're on to the big boys, so to speak. Um, this is a new one, actually. This is the regulator modulus. Since the last one shorted out, we have enough bullets to shoot each mode. I'm going to do single fire with the single mag, semi-auto with the 10 mag, and full auto with the 10 mag. So reloading again. Super easy. Push button, pick out, and ready to fire. So let's get on the firing range. All right. Starting off easy with, sem with single fire. That's a 10 mag. Oh, I, ju I just realized I said I was going to be doing a 6 mag for that, but whatever. 6 mag for semi then. Oh, that's not semi auto, that's burst mode. <laughs> and then finally, full auto. Oh, Lord. And that's really it for the regulator. Onto the sniper. Cool thing about this gun is when it's done shooting, it actually um, has a red light that just went flashing, so it's pretty cool. And onto the sniper. Alright, loading this thing is a breeze, so you kind of have to have two hands to do this. So bear with me. It is a sniper after all. I'm probably not even in frame. Alright, so once you get the magazine in, pull down the extremely long barrel and it'll shoot up, and then it's ready for firing. I also have a red dot equipped right now for maximum accuracy. I don't know. I'll be aiming for the door. I have six shots. Oh, it's stuck. Sorry, guys. Why is there a bullet going backwards? <laughs> Sorry. I was wondering why it wasn't shooting. This thing hurts a lot. I know I didn't show this class. This is the archery class. The reason I didn't show it was because it didn't really have any customizations. This is the Nerf Mega Bow. This is a wall. And this is the finale. Wow! <laughs> Here are some guns that I didn't put on the list because they kind of suck. Uh, this is the Mega Magnus. Um, the reason I hate it is because it takes a pain to reload. The jo Everyone knows why people hate the jolts. Single shot, they're the smallest ever. Barely fit in your hand. Anyway, let's get to the testing. Let's hope they don't jam, because they're bad. Starting off with the Magnus. The only good thing about the Magnus is that it's got power, but it's way up high on aiming. Like, I got dual wieldable jolts. I'll demonstrate these because it is kind of fun to flip them. It's about all they're meant for. Oh my god, yeah, I could put two more bullets in them, but not exactly any good. Most inaccurate thing I've ever seen in the next 10 minutes.
They're everywhere. Alright, I'll do an outro in a sec, but I gotta clean this up. Yeah.